all right guys so today we have caspa putting in a new all-time high goes with no surprise seeing what caspa has been doing recently all-time high after all-time high as i've been covering it here on my channel recently guys i told you this thing is just going on a massive run it's not gonna stop anytime soon which raises a lot of questions right now is caspa going for one dollar how high caspa is going right now is it gonna stop if you're holding caspa right now should you sell or should you wait for higher prices this is what we're gonna be looking at here in today's video guys so with no further ado let's get into it and as usual don't forget to leave a like and subscribe now here guys on today's candle caspa put in a new all-time high which is almost close to a 17 cents which goes with no surprise guys if you've seen my previous caspa video i told you descending triangles usually they do break out to the upside and we could target the previous all-time highs and exactly as predicted we've seen it going back there right now so for the short term what should you be expecting for those right now that like to zoom in go to those lower time frames and see what's going on here exactly now as you can see recently here guys since caspa broke out it's seen some sort of a kind of consolidation around these prices here around the 13 14 cents and then suddenly seen a spike took out the previous all-time high now we're seeing a pullback which is a normal thing to see after a new all-time high so usually this plays out with a retest of the previous all-time high and a continuation to the upside so now for the short term for those interested i do think this gonna be kind of ranging somewhere here again we're gonna see some consolidation in these prices and then we're gonna see another leg up very possibly you could still go back test that orange line you see here which is a view up which usually kind of sustains the price action when we see strong upsides like we're seeing right now here anyways guys now when it comes to the long term is caspa going for one dollar is caspa going higher now guys caspa works on a proof of work consensus where there needs to be a mining behind the scenes going on on that back end for that blockchain to function and over the years we've seen many proof of work coins like monero or zcash or litecoin or even dogecoin a lot of those coins come in each bull market and we see them pulling in some major rallies usually and they do find themselves strong narratives like back in the days with zcash in 2017 and monero we've seen a lot of hype around them back then so we can use monero today to kind of predict where caspa is going now caspa we can see the hash rate is growing which means a lot of miners are joining the rigs right now a lot of miners are joining that caspa hype a lot of miners are mining caspa and the price increase that we see today will just help on board even more miners as right now the mining profits are gonna increase as caspa right now price is higher so miners can sell their caspa for higher prices but these kind of price increases and this kind of rallies that we see today on caspa usually mean that there is a lot of hodling going around a lot of people are not selling and it, this in my opinion could just be the miners that are mining a lot of caspa right now and they are not selling it as they are expecting higher prices and they do not want to sell right now as it makes sense now if you are mining caspa you don't want to sell at the lows as you think now caspa is gonna go even to higher prices as it is today only at 3.5 billion dollars and i say only because we are going to be looking at what monero did in the past with its market cap now monero market cap back in 2021 went as high as eight billion dollars and in 2017 went as high as seven billion dollars and we could compare these prices or this market cap to today's caspa market cap so now today caspa is at 3.5 billion dollars now where we at in the market cycle is very likely we are somewhere here around that 2020 kind of phase of the cycle where bitcoin just started getting closer to its previous all-time high and breaking out and starting a bull run before we seen the real rally on monero so back then here monero was around one billion dollars in its market cap which means guys now today at the same level caspa is at 3.5 billion which means now caspa is three times higher than monero back then before the start of the 2021 bull market and it's a three times higher than monero back then when we've seen monero at these lows now does this means that caspa is gonna put in a three times 
higher run than the one we've seen on Monero or Zcash. This can possibly be the case as as well we do have now more capital in the crypto space there is more liquidity in the crypto space more people more hype this means it's just gonna drive caspa market cap way higher and as monero topped around eight billion dollars market cap and if we just go by the fact that now caspa is tripling that of what monero did back then we could just expect a 30 billion dollars market cap on caspa just by repeating what monero did back then which means a 10x from those prices and what kind of market cap do we need for caspa to reach that one dollar so the total supply on caspa is 22 billion 700 million so if we need the price to get to one dollar we need the market cap to be exactly 22 billion 716 million dollars in its market cap which is largely achievable if we see the same run that we've seen on monero and given the fact that caspa right now is tripling that of what monero did in the past and as well the given the fact that we have way higher liquidity today in the crypto space than back then in 2020 or 2019 or even or even way back in 2017 so this largely answers the question is caspa going to one dollar this is very very likely to happen if we do compare monero with caspa now remember you should not take this to the bank this is not financial advice this is just my analysis and going from what we got today here and historical data and things that we've seen in the past especially with monero zcash and those coins that do come and go now would it be also a right time to sell around that one dollar now we should know that one dollar should be a real strong psychological level given the fact as well that we do have a lot of miners joining that caspa train and most of them probably right now are basing their business model around caspa going to one dollar and accumulating as much caspa as possible and possibly they are counting how much they can make as soon as caspa reaches that one dollar which we all know is a psychological level most people are not gonna go through the hassle of doing some technical analysis or looking at historical data to kind of base their business models on mining caspa so possibly that one dollar mark is gonna be a huge strong resistance on caspa and possibly gonna be the right time to be taking some profits on caspa but it's still way ahead of us right now here and i do think in my humble opinion any dips right now on caspa should be taken as an opportunity while we get towards that one dollar as i said guys now i strongly believe that most of this run that we see on caspa here is driven by miners holding as they do not want to sell at lower prices as they are joining they are spending tons of money as you can see on these rigs they do cost some money and they are kind of counting on caspa running up and that's what's happening that's what's choking the price as people are not selling and this thing is just gonna keep going up and the largest holders are possibly the miners in my opinion so i would love to hear your opinion as well you can leave it in the comment section and as usual nothing is financial advice and thank you so much for watching this video till the end i'll see you on the next one cheers